So we'll give uh, the mainland wide berths, avoid any kind of rocks. Nice long episode. We're doing for time. I can rumba. Splish splash. I bet this water's absolutely freezing. We did see the ice. So I reckon is that where the blacksmith is? Oh no, this must be that part of there. That's one thing you could do with Skyrim. You'd be looking at that going, I can get up that, no problem. I can jump it, or I could use my horse. My horse can go up <laughs> sheer slopes. In The Witcher, you're like, no, nah, no chance. Is that a little altar? Avoid the icebergs. I wonder if you get frost damage if I s fall in the water here. If that, I was suddenly start taking damage because it's so freezing. I'll just check that everything is recording, which it is. Blah, 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 blah. I wonder how the uh, developers expected you to get around to the blacksmith and Udvik. Um, Kalishmar, I mean. Give me my mission. That sun is so bright. It's great having this freedom in this game, just to be able to do this. thing it's missing is maybe a few clouds being caught at the top of the, uh, the peak and the wind blowing off snow off some of the uh, edges just to make it feel really proper cold I'm not noticing any seals or any kind of like sea mammal creatures, you know, the nice ones. Probably got ate by all the sirens. So if I, be, if I was doing this, this for real, I'd be looking out for seals, I'd be looking out for dolphins. Uh, that sort of stuff. Jellyfish. I hate jellyfish. No creature is allowed to have arms that long. It's, it's just not natural. Wow, they really didn't want you to go, go around this way, did they?
talking about on, on the map, am I? Uh, I reckon once I get there, then we might start seeing some place where we can dock and make some progress. Interesting. I think there might be something on the land there. But my boat is far too precious to risk getting damaged there. You would not last long in water this cold. I remember one time when I was at university and uh, I, don't know, I was in living in halls and for some reason there was a problem with the heating on this one day and it only ever happened once and I had to take this bath and it was cold. It was proper cold. And just, just the idea of trying to like submerge, lean back and submerge my face underneath the water, I just, it was like, I just couldn't bear the idea it really felt like when the cold water hit you it's like someone was punching your chest it really did feel that someone just went fuck yeah when that's like that really cold water hit you right let's get out here I think I see the path. Trying to do some counter, uh, some parry in there. Oh, uh, yep, hitting them with marshmallows. Finish them off with a couple of heavy attacks there, you know, just to spice things up a bit. Get some food on. Get my coin up. Let's sort out these this toxicity. Yeah, so that's Yeah, yeah, I've got two portions just about a fade any second there, but my toxicity is still really high. So we'll drink that. Oh, and the good thing's still there. Well, that's good. So now we can look at what else. Uh, I'm liking the idea of that. Uh, no. Not sure what happened there. Um, anything that 
keeps me alive. Looks like rain. Yeah, there's one thing that Skyrim got right. You ran faster when you had your weapon sheathed. And it was a nice touch because it made sense for, for you to then um, sheath your weapon. Should have taken the left turn at Albuquerque there, I realise. Slide. Do love that sliding animation. Really do feel railroaded into going to a set direction. Will that sleeping bears lie? Saruman's tower over there. What the blazes are these? Ice troll. Oh, I saw the. Uh, Oh, I was trying to push him off the edge there. Not bad. We added ice trolls, awkward oil, and quen. Yeah. Hybrid awkward oil. Speak to the blacksmith first. I'm gonna tick that box, scratch that itch. Ah, get up there! Where's my path gone? Crikey! Uh, so let's slow it down to a walk here. Well, I suppose he did give me a fair warning. Oh, 
Nice beef you got here. Oh, right on the edge. The reason why I didn't want to uh, attack and kill him, because he gave me fair one, like, just to get out. I don't want to fight him. I thought, oh, okay, fair enough. I mean, someone did a home invasion on you with his silver sword drawn. You'd be like, what the hell? Oh, nimble. Someone there. I was trying to get the loot. Split her in two. Get your sword out. And now it's all dark again. Don't really want to be running around in a dark cave with no light. I'll end up running off the edge of a cliff. Where's it gone? Shot half a quiver into her. Who? Who? Nice tree. Who shot half a quiver into her? Exactly like what I've got on. Tunnel caved in. Have I gone off the beaten track? I I, I came into this cave thinking that the uh the blacksmith supplies would be in here. Well, I think I might have just missed my blacksmith. That's getting through. Got up in here all year.
Oh, that's impressive, but I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do with that. That's not what I meant. Yeah, so let's see if we can sort this mess out. 58%. Good God. I think this uh, blacksmith is uh, just on the other side of the cave. I must have just missed him. 98, 98, 97, 92. They're all fine. All fine here. Potions. That's good. Okay, that's good as well. Yeah. Where's the interior map? That would be a nice touch as well. Because there is sod all around here that looks like a blacksmith. Oh, I've just noticed a tunnel down there. In fact, there's something. get the torch going. This is obviously part of some quests. I'm just not sure which quest that is. Blunt pickaxe. No you got I don't see the point in picking up. Them. I suppose he could be trapped down at the bottom. I would have to like leave, then get back at the surface, and then realize, oh, he's not ah. here. Hello. Yalmar lost a lot of men here. All right. Okay. So it looks like we're doing the Yalmar quest rather than the blacksmith quest. So let's bring that up here. Explore the ruins of Erskar and search for signs of Helmar's peasantry in your witcher sense. <sighs> oh, I've just kind of appeared midway through Sliced the quest. Her up. Two men, looks like. Robert Pell, I'll take that. See, this is a little annoying. It's not being able to have, you know, the torch and the um, the crossbow on different quick keys, and that's purely to uh, satisfy the console people. It's like I've got a kajillion buttons in front of me. Give me the option, eh? Fought to the bitter end. Clean cut. Head probably went flying. Is that this night sky we can see out there? No, oh, picked up an empty bottle, didn't mean that. Um, where did said tat go to? Ah, oh, it's underneath this section. Oh, it's well, it's weightless, so... That's okay, then. Are we going underwater? Hello, body under the water. I'm not even sure my crossbow could reach that far. I'm trying to aim underwater, it does not help. Come on!
comedy. Oh, don't, don't punch at the bloody siren. Can't see it, it's so dark. Can I just like set fire to a crossbow bolt and shoot it and then, then I'll be able to see it? Arena beast uh, entry added. Oh, let's go under. Where did it go? There it is. Black magic doll. Keep a very close eye on my breath counter this time. Job done. Oh, and then it threw itself across the beach. Take some of that. Is this like gold veins in the uh, rocks? Certainly some kind of precious metal. Yeah, I don't think I've really got time, Bunny, to uh, be mining. Turned around. I have got turned around. I caramba. I need a bigger torch. Oh well. No blacksmith around here. Let's head towards this uh, big exit. Now where did I see that skyline? Black. I cannot see a damn thing. Do I have any cat's eye still? I'm trying to squeeze through that gap and it's not letting me. Just checking if there's anything beneath the water, like a, a cave. Another black magic doll. Oh. Stick to this left wall. I think this is the way we came up. Yeah, there's the sky. Keep a close eye on this. Oh, I see. And when I get closer, the graphic kind of catch up. So it is actually just a cave wall there. That's why I was getting very confused. Okay, there's not an exit out of here. And again, I go to the world map thinking there's a little mini map inside, and there's not.
Doesn't look like we are going out, but I've got a feeling that we'll be coming back here. Clean cut. Head probably went flying. Well, I'm going to be running this to try and save time. Let's put a cheeky quick save in there for when I hopefully don't run off the edge. You know, save for the best. Damn sirens back and there's nowhere. Is that the same place? That is the same place, isn't it? and flying and I think I cut that rock in two look at that that's that's <laughs> swordsmanship right there uh, lost me cat's eye that looks like a dead end I get the impression this tree is gonna mean something to someone but just not at the moment I'm going to have to down that other potion because I can't see where I'm going. Why can't you do a running jump and catch of the ladders? Nothing there. Okay. I cannot remember. It was 50 50. <laughs> Have I been down that way? Superior dancing star. Nice. Uh, I'll investigate that when I'm out in broad daylight. Oh good, that didn't take me half as long as I thought feared it was going to. Let's check the map. Come on little dotted line, don't fail me now. Why is it pointing at the ice troll? Do I have to stop? No, it's not actually. I thought it was. Oh yeah, it's kind of pointing at this point. Ow! Do you mind? basically just going in every time I see he reach back for a uh, piece of rock. Well, that didn't burn that time. Oh, kinda got stuck there, Garrett. Move! Jump! Oh, why can you not jump when you're in combat? How ridiculous! Oh, do you see that skillful dock underneath the rock there? Ouch! Couldn't see it coming. Must be that legendary forge. Need to look around for tools. That's where I was going wrong. I was thinking I was looking for an actual blacksmith, not just his tools. High quality smithing tools, there you go. Blacksmithing tools. 
but ornamented. Gotta be the ones Joanna mentioned. I thought I was gonna meet a master armorer there. This is a fabulous set of tools, and we're gonna have a quest, and we're gonna have big good times. Go to the island, they say. You'll have a good time, they said. Death wind. And I think I will leave it there for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, please like, subscribe, leave me a comment. And until next time, from myself, Indigo, Roach, and Boney, take care of yourself. And goodbye for now. <laughs>